My name is Natalie Vokes. I'm an assistant professor in the departments of genomic medicine and thoracic oncology at MD Anderson Cancer Center. I was awarded the SITSI Genentech Women in Cancer Immunotherapy Fellowship in the spring of 2020, right as everything was shutting down for the COVID-19 pandemic. And at that time, I was actually finishing my oncology fellowship at the Dana-Farber and applying for a faculty position at MD Anderson. But because of the pandemic, my hire was frozen. And so having the support and the recognition of the SITSI Gen and Tech Fellowship was actually instrumental in allowing my department chair to push my hire through despite the COVID-19 related hiring freezes. Since being here at MD Anderson as a new faculty, having this fellowship has allowed me to build out new patient cohorts, really get my research going, and to establish collaborations here with other scientists and clinicians. My research lies at the intersection of clinical computational oncology and cancer care. Clinically, I see patients with lung cancer, and my research focuses on applying uh, computational techniques to molecular data from lung cancer patients to understand differential response to targeted therapies and immune checkpoint inhibitors. I'm particularly interested in understanding why some patients don't respond to immune checkpoint inhibitors, and my current research involves uh, building out uh, cohorts of patients with pre- and post-treatment biopsies on whom we've done bulk uh, transcriptomic and single-cell profiling to understand how the tumor biology and the particular biology of that patient's immune system interact to um, lead to immunotherapy response or resistance. I'm a member of SITSI because uh, it's an incredible organization that uh, brings together the latest in immunotherapy and immuno-oncology. There is a wealth of educational programming and they also have a number of uh, conferences and workshops that allow me to stay at the forefront of the field as well as to connect with and collaborate with other scientists in this arena. In my free time, I have two young children. I have a almost four-year-old and a 20-month-year-old uh, girl. And so I spend a lot of time uh, chasing after them, uh, trying to encourage them to sleep. Um, and when I'm not doing those things, I enjoy uh, reading fiction and cooking. <laughs>